What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, I'm going to be talking about Dylan Ray Dunes. I think that's how you say it. Uh, tackle out of North Dakota State. And he is fantastic, man. Uh, he's another guy that really did really well at the Senior Bowl. And um, I went ahead and looked at his film, and yeah, it matches. Um, he gets his hands inside pretty effectively. Uh, he's got good knee bend, keeps his feet moving through contact. As a whole, his feet are pretty solid. I wouldn't say that they're like top tier uh, footwork, but it's solid as hell. Um, gets the job done. Um, he doesn't miss with his hands at all. Um, and he's also got some pretty long arms that he knows how to use effectively. Honestly, he has all the tools to be a solid tackle. Um, competition, of course, is going to be a question because, you know, it is a D2 school. But like I said, that's what the Senior Bowl is all about is you being able to show yourself uh, against higher competition. And he kicked people's ass. Uh, he went in there and did better than a lot of the big names going in, like Alex Leatherwood. I, I like this guy way better than Alex Leatherwood, to be honest, from Alabama. Um, I definitely think this guy's a first-round talent, for sure, just because tackle prospects are rare. Uh, you don't get too many of them, and the league is so desperate for tackle help that he's probably going to be a first-rounder. Like, in most drafts, even bad offensive tackles go in the first two rounds. And this guy's solid as shit. I don't think like he's like a generational talent or anything like that, but I think you can plug this guy in and he'll give you some solid reps at tackle day one. Um, I think he can come in and start for you and be fine. He's not going to whoop your ass right away. I think he can continue to develop into being potentially like a Pro Bowl level player. I think he does have that potential. But I think right now he can step in and at least be competent for you. Uh, I, I like him a lot. I, I do. Uh, he shows all the traits I need. Um, like I said, the, ha the hands are always the most important thing for me with an offensive lineman. And it, his are super consistent. Uh, he gets them inside consistently. And once he does, he, he's pretty good at locking you down. And he keeps his feet moving. And he also doesn't seem to really get confused on who he's supposed to block. So, yeah. Uh, if, if anything, the one thing I'd say is continue to improve your feet. And maybe get a little bit stronger, too. Uh, he's 6'5", about 304, so maybe get a little stronger. But strength isn't a problem for him, but there's always room for improvement, right? And like I said, I think his feet, they're fine now. They're fine where they're at. But if you can make them even better, I wouldn't complain. So, yeah. Anyway, um, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, I'd appreciate hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.